Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Jay Patel. I'm a PA here at MyFitMed. Here I cover wide range of topics that may help improve your overall health and performance. The goal is to help you get in the best shape of your life and be the best version of yourself. Enjoy the video. Today I'm going to talk about testosterone and its effect on your heart and cardiovascular health. TRT has been a topic of concern when it comes to a cardiovascular health. With a lot of misconceptions surrounding this treatment, it is very important to know the facts. Today, I'm going to highlight the key finding from the study, the Travers trial, that just came out this year. This study was published in 2023 in the New England Journal of Medicine. New England Journal of Medicine is one of the prestigious journals in the medical community. The study was designed to address whether the testosterone replacement therapy increases the risk of cardiovascular event in men with the history of cardiovascular disease or men that are at higher risk of cardiovascular disease and have a low level of testosterone, also known as hypogonadism. This double-branded randomized uh, study included 5,246 men. All the participants in the study either had a history of cardiovascular diseases or were at the higher risk of cardiovascular diseases. The age range was 45 to 80, with the mean age being 63 year old. 47% of them were older than 65 year old. Mean BMI was 35. 70% had diabetes and more than 90% had hypertension. All the participants had a diagnosis of hypogonadism. They were tested early morning, two separate times, 48 hours apart, and had a, a testosterone level of less than 300, which is a definition of hypogonadism. And along with the blood test, all the participants had at least one symptom of hypogonadism or low testosterone. All the participants were given randomly a transdermal testosterone gel or a placebo gel for about 22 months and were monitored for 32 months. The doses were adjusted to keep their testosterone level in between 350 to 720. The study found no significant difference in the cardiovascular event in testosterone versus the placebo group, even for the individual that had very high risk of cardiovascular diseases. Now, testosterone being safe from the cardiovascular perspective doesn't mean that everybody should start testosterone replacement therapy. Testosterone replacement therapy is only for people that are diagnosed with hypogonadism or have low level of testosterone and have a symptoms of low testosterone. Also the TRT also known as testosterone replacement therapy should always be done under the supervision of medical provider and while you are on TRT you have to make sure that you are getting your regular blood work done and making sure that your level are in the normal optimal range. TRT or testosterone replacement therapy does come with other side effects. So make sure you are following up with your medical provider and always do the testosterone replacement therapy under the supervision of your provider. Hope you enjoyed the video and learned something about how to optimize your overall health. Talk to your medical provider before starting any medication or treatment. Comment below and let us know what other topics you want us to cover. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more educational video. Thank you guys for watching.